CatCon day one is over. Let's go over my CatCon haul and some of my highlights of the day. So this is the CatCon bag. Um, everyone who registers for CatCon uh, gets a bag. Inside the bag, you get a CatCon directory. And then all of this next stuff is stuff that I picked up for free in the exhibit hall. Um, I got this sample of Gentle Harvest Meat Me Chibbles. This is 100% chicken treats. Basically, this is a dehydrated chicken that has been pulverized into like a powder. Um, they say you could sprinkle this on your pet's food as like a treat. I got this Fussy Cat Premium Cat Food uh, sample pack. Um, so this is a small box. And then inside, is a sample of their cat foods. This is um, a tuna with ocean fish formula wet food. This is a chicken and turkey recipe dry food. And then this is a salmon recipe dry food. Um, I haven't read ingredients on any of this or anything. These will be great uh, for the cats to try or to uh, give to the outdoor cats um, as food. Some people from Pet Stages were there and I got to talk to them and I got this Pet Stages catalog of all of Pet Stages products. Now Stella's green scratch and roll is made by Pet Stages and Simba's chew toy, that wiggle worm, is also made by Pet Stages. So I really like their products and it was really nice to get to um, meet some people that work for the company. Rachel Ray Nutrish cat food um, was also there and they were giving out these sample bags. Um, this is their indoor complete chicken with lentils and salmon recipe. Uh, so I got a few bags of this along with information about the food. Litter Robot was there. Um, so I picked up some information about Litter Robot and I got two of these Meow air fresheners. Frontline had a booth so I got a a sample of their frontline gold for cats and they also had these cute little tote bags that say are you kidding me pet cube also had a booth and i got this information on their new product it's um, a pet cube that dispenses treats so if you're not home you can remotely dispense treats for your pet and then they were also giving away uh, these cute little laser pointer toys for cats so i got one of these and the world's best cat litter which i use for the cats um, also had a large booth and I'm pretty sure that's where these um, cat ears came from and they also were giving away um, these um, sweepstakes codes um, you could win a car and um, these buttons these are some of the various business cards um, from people that I met I got this white reusable tote bag from Viagen Pets uh, it says viagenpets.com. I really don't know what they do. Their uh, booth was kind of empty, so. Primal Pet Foods was there, um, so they gave me some samples of their freeze-dried turkey formula. I told them that I just bought a big bag of the uh, raw frozen turkey formula, and the cats were enjoying that. So they gave me a bunch of coupons, $2.50 off of any feline item, which will definitely come in handy because raw food's expensive. Then I got these cute little pins. I got three samples of this Inaba Chow Churu. Uh, this is a squeezable cat treat. I never saw these before, so they gave me one for each of the indoor cats. I got two little black cat temporary tattoos. I picked these up because I thought they reminded me of Boo. I got this pen. I don't know if you could see that, but there's a cat shape. Uh, on the end of it, it says gokittycat.com and then I have two more temporary cat tattoos this is from Cats Rule now let me show you what I bought I bought this like industrial strength um, it feels like it's like galvanized steel litter scoop with a telescoping handle so this handle pulls out and it makes a long handled litter scoop so you don't have to bend down to get into the litter I got this on a show deal it was like uh, $14.99. This is really going to come in handy for scooping out the litter boxes that I have that are the non-sift litter box. And this gives you an idea on how to use it and how the handle of the scoop extends. So I'll most likely be doing a product review video 
uh, on this one. So uh, it says stand up and scoop. Thought it was interesting. And if uh, it makes it easier and quicker to clean out litter boxes, I like it. And then, because Simba loves wearing hats, I got him this Christmas tree hat. It's handmade um, by an artist from Massachusetts, and she also has an Etsy shop, and it's really, really cute, and it was $12. So, I think he's going to enjoy wearing that around Christmas. And I got him this monster hat for Halloween. He looked really cute in this also. This was also $12. So at night, after CatCon closed for the day, there were parties and National Geographic sponsored a party. It was Nat Geo Wild. So I got this uh, reusable bag. Inside the bag, they gave you these electronic cat ears. They're really cool. So these light up in like blue neon lights. That's what it looks like and they blink. And here's like the battery pack. I saw some people wearing these. I didn't realize these were in the bag. I just uh, found them uh, when I got back. They also gave you a Nat Geo Wild cookie, um, a decorated cookie that was awesome. You got these when you walked out the door, gift bag, cookie. And they gave you an I Love Big Cats Big Button. This is, I don't know, like a three and a half, four inch button, It's pretty big. And then after that party, we went to the Rachel Ray Nutrish party where they had a craft table and you can make your own cat ears. So I made this one with purple pom-poms and purple jewels. They had hot glue guns and all kinds of jewelry supplies and craft supplies. Um, so that was cute. Then I also made this one. Um, it's like a black and gold frame. So I thought adding um, the gold ribbon to the ears uh, looked cute, so I made these two. They were also giving away more bags of this Rachel Ray Nutrish dry cat food. They gave away these really cute stickers, 100% Catitude, You Are Clawsome, and just a bunch of like cat emojis, and you have cat to be kitting me right now. And they also gave away these um, reusable plastic uh, drinking cups. This was actually a BuzzFeed Presents Party Right Meow uh, sponsored by Rachel Ray Nutrish. Um, so I got one of these. They give you this when you left the party so you didn't have to hold it uh, all night. And then I also got this large Cat's Rule tote bag um, when I made the purchase at their booth. So this is my CatCon haul from day one. Four bags of stuff and I'm really happy because I know I'll have enough room in my suitcase for all of this because I brought an extra large suitcase with me. I get one free check bag um, so I figured I might as well take advantage of that and check a larger suitcase than I would normally need. I could have easily just put my stuff in a carry-on size suitcase and been done with it but then I would not be able to get like all of this stuff home so I was smart this time and I decided to bring a bigger suitcase than I need, leave it half empty, check the bag because I get it checked for free, and then I'll have plenty of room to bring stuff back. 